welcome to episode number 45 of this Bobby Crosby Jr. Road of the Show series. And in this one, Junior's Giants are taking on the Phillies and Junior's on the mound. Crosby Jr. is an amazing specimen of a human being, although he won't be a human being for too much longer because he has a bad case of gigantism and he refuses all treatment, so he will die fairly soon, but he doesn't mind. Live fast, die young, hit dingers, win Cy Young Awards. That's his whole plan, and look at that. He's starting on the mound. He's 6'10", 290 pounds. He was born on a boat in a forgotten sea to a 7'9 mother, the tallest woman in the world at the time who his father, Crosby Sr., met on a sightseeing mission to Norway uh, an unspecified time ago. No one knows Junior's true age. He's somewhere between 9 and 16. His parents um, have very poor memories, and they suffer from various maladies themselves. And they don't know when they met. They don't know when Junior was born. They don't even know where he was born. No one knows. It's a forgotten sea. Does it make sense? It does to certain deities, but uh, not to any mere humans. Bryce Harper up. That's Junior against Harper. We're going with a fork ball now over here. Junior, by the way, incredible pitcher. He uh, has not given up a run this year in 15 innings. Now 15 and two-third innings. I think that's his, his stat line. We're going with the high fastball here. He's taken uh, no hitter into, I think, at least the seventh inning in both of his first two starts. I think he's given up two hits on the year in 15 innings, now 16 innings, something like that. He's done incredibly well. He, uh, he also had a 461-foot home run during his last start on the mound. He's wearing horrible-looking socks, though. Here's a fastball. Just horrendous socks, which I'm probably going to change soon, even though they do help me. The challenge there was to end the inning without allowing a run or a walk. Fastball. That can't drop, but it will. No! That's painful. There goes the no-hitter. There goes the perfect game. But that's okay. We're going to try to hit a longer home run than we did in our previous start, which was a 461-foot home run. Curveball. Beautiful. Now we're going to go sinker, first sinker of the day, and get a little double play ball. How about it? Almost. He was trying to hit it over there to Brandon Belt. Now we're going to go sinker over there. And, yes, we've got that. I'm trying. Let me catch it. Okay, I dove. I dove. Show that I care. Now I'm just running aimlessly. Sinker. Ground ball. Okay, I was trying. I was trying. We're going to go with a curve ball now. Ground ball to third. Five, four, three. Ooh. And the high fastball for the strikeout. You, sir, are done. Beautiful. Real Muto angry, but it was right there. It was right there. Fork ball. There we go. Easy ground ball. And nice. All right. Now Crosby's going to come up in the third. There he is, Crosby Jr. An incredible human being. At least most people agree that he's human. Most scientists have agreed. Not all, but a good, you know, 67% of scientists agree that this is a human man. Please get out. He's not going to catch it. Yes, that's a triple. Awesome. Okay. Oh, please. Safe. Triple. Nice. Good job. Scared me. Thought they were going to call him out for a second. His slide is so slow. Uh, now he's got the jacket on. Should we steal home with the jacket on and those socks? That would be ridiculous. We're thinking about it. We're thinking about it, Ant. No, not yet. Okay. 2-2 two -two count. He swung, apparently, at that one. He took a hack. Um, I really want to steal home. This guy takes forever to throw it. Don't pick me off third. Okay, and... That's three outs. All right, but we hit a triple. We did a good job. Leave me in long enough to get the cycle. That would be amazing. We're going to have to score a bunch of runs, though, to get me up four times. Belt, don't give up on things. Okay, you had no chance at that one. Fork ball now to Segura. Beautiful. Now we're going to go with our first slider of the day. Right there for the swing and miss. Yep. Too easy. We have not thrown a complete game yet this season. This is only our third start, though. We went... Seven innings and eight innings, and we've got that. Too easy. 
quick out there. And now we're going to get another quick out. I think a one pitch out right here. We're going fastball. We get a little fly ball to right. No. Now we're going to go curveball. Ground ball to short. All right. They can't really touch it, Crosby. Fastball. Swing and miss. Or just look at it. Good job. Good job. How many hits have we given up? It's one, right? Yeah. One little bloop single. Fastball. Oh. Painting the corners. Fork ball. Ground ball to second. They can't touch it. Slider. Swing and miss should be. Mm. Umpire, do you want to lose your limbs? When Crosby Jr. gets squeezed by umpires, you know what he does? Rips off their arms and or legs. Sometimes he just first picks the juiciest one um, and just goes for it. Just rips it off with his bare hands. No tools required. Um, he's got that. And sometimes he just starts ripping and doesn't stop until the umpire has no limbs left at all. It's kind of crazy. Um, keep in mind this is a fictional story. Incredibly fictional. This is not real. There's no such thing as a forgotten sea anymore in the 2021 world we're currently living in. And if you're watching this in like the year 2037, which I'm sure at least, you know, a couple of you are. Yeah, doesn't that sound weird? This 2021 world we're living in? It's possible that you're like 15 years old watching this in 2037. You were born in 2022. And you're like, I never lived in a 2021 world. That's gone. Thank you. We just need a single and a double for the cycle. Where is it? 399. 399. We're going to see in the bottom right corner, hopefully. We don't see the distance when I'm a pitcher hitting homers unless we do the show track for some reason. That's what happened on my 461-foot homer in the previous start Crosby had on the mound. So 399 is my guess, and we should see the distance 388, 11 feet off. So right there on that height, it's 388. Nice catch by the man in the green hat. We're going to go fastball to McCutcheon. I once caught, by the way, an Andrew McCutcheon home run in real life, a game home run. Uh, it was pretty epic. It was what? May 1st, 2008 which is 2008, 2010, May 1st, 2010. And uh, that's sad for my memory that I got the year wrong there. It's been a while. It's been 11 years since I caught that. He was a rookie. Well, technically a rookie. Um, or was he technically a second-year player? I'm not sure if he qualified in 2009 for being a rookie or not but in any case it was his 16th career home run so that's how long ago it was back in a world where Andrew McCutcheon had only hit 15 home runs prior to coming up that day and depositing that ball into my glove slider right here 44th pitch beautiful for Crosby they might let him go nine I need quick outs because I need them to let me stay in long enough to get four at bats so I pretty much just have to throw pitches down the middle, get quick outs. If I give up a few more hits that way, so be it. Fork ball. All right, it wasn't quite down the middle. Slide piece. Just swing and miss, buddy. No, fair ball. Uh, I like how the ball boy is so late. Oh, throw. Oh, come on. He's safe. All right, fine. Uh, we're only up one nothing on Crosby's homer. Curveball, ground ball to third. Umpire, you hate your limbs so much. You hate, there we go. Don't you dare drop. Don't you dare, thank you. Whoa. All right, get me up now. Please, come up, come up. Yes, base is loaded. Base is loaded. Home run the triple. Okay. How about, how about a single or a double? Come on, or a grand slam. I did not try to check that. Getting nervous, though. Okay, come on. I tried to hit the button fully. Junior. Single. Double now for the cycle. Double for the cycle. S out. Okay, safe. That was close. That was close. This is an epic game right now. I just have to come up one more time, and I'm almost guaranteed to do so. Unless they have a big inning here. Wow. And we're up 5 nothing. 
We're gonna go. We're gonna go high fastball. Right there, and yes. Okay, the cycle could happen as a starting pitcher. Wow, that's never happened uh, in real life, and I've never even hit for the cycle with the dingers loadout, my hitter loadout. There we go. Brandon Belt's got that. He did sort of cost me a perfect game recently uh, with bad defense. But fastball, he also hit a home run in that game for the only run to give me the win. So I thank him, actually. He, 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 there was no way he was going to get that ball anyway. Brandon Belt, good job. Nice. Give me up again. Probably not yet, but let's see. Nope, not yet. Got to face Bryce Harper. Fastball, 57th pitch. I think this might be the complete game shutout day. Man, only the bloop single and then, oh, man. That's their, what, third hit. Throw him out. Oh, throw the ball quicker. Safe. I did not see enough hustle. That's a leadoff, man. Oh, we're up 5 nothing. So that's good. Leadoff, double. But we have a cushion of five runs. Fastball. We've got that, right? Yeah. Okay, good. Nice job. That was the, what, 60th pitch, I believe, from Crosby Jr. And McCutcheon up again. Fastball pop-up. Yeah, there we go. There's a pop-up. Shortstop man has that. That was only the 61st pitch. Back-to-back -back pitches were popped up to short left, and here's a fastball. That was hit pretty deep to left, but very foul by Real Muto. Fork ball. Okay, now we strike him out on the slider low and in. Right there for the swing and miss. No, but ground ball. Tag him. All right, fine, fine, fine. Oh, bad camera work there, but here we go. Double for the cycle. Double for the cycle. Average up to 451. Just hit a gapper. We'll be going for two. No! No! Awful, and I'm not going to come up again. That's the third out. <sighs> Had a good chance. Had a good chance. Uh, 65th pitch right now, and that's as easy as it gets. Just a lazy liner to the shortstop. Didn't get the cycle, but should, fork ball, but should actually get the complete game shutout, I think. We're going to go, he can't hit that. We're going to go fastball again right there. Swing and miss. No, foul ball. Now we go slider low and in. That should be the swing and miss. Yep. This is good. Four more outs and we've thrown 69 pitches. So there's no reason whatsoever why they should take me out. There we go. Oh, it's me. I've got it. No. Oh, my gosh. If he homers... Uh, I do have a scoreless inning streak going now of, um, this is eight, 23 innings to start the season without giving up a run. Let me pitch the ninth. Yes, here we go. Letting me pitch the ninth. 72nd pitch. Uh-oh. He's got it. Beautiful. All right, we're going to have like a 77 pitch, um, shutout. That's epic. And fastball. 73rd pitch. There we go. How about a three-pitch inning in the ninth? That was the 73rd pitch. Here comes the 74th pitch. And it's Harper. We'll pop it up. 74th pitch. There we go. No. Oh, I knew we had the shift going. I thought it wouldn't sneak through, but it did. Okay. I haven't been doing the thing lately where I run over and say never hit the ball off me again. I should probably be doing that. Curveball. Come on. Foul, thank you. Now we're going to go fork ball over here. 76th pitch. Now we can strike him out on the 77th pitch for the win. Shutout for Junior. Yes! Beautiful. First shutout for Junior. They let him go the distance. That was awesome. Didn't I predict the number of pitches? Was that 77? Nice job, Junior. They love him. Uh, really silenced the Philadelphia crowd. That was awesome. In my opinion, that was great. Four-hit shutout. Yes. Oh, interesting way that he 
high fives, people. If you like this, one of the like button. Subscribe if you haven't. Tell your friends about these videos. You know what? I'm going to see you in episode number 46.